Top of the morning, folks. Here we are, coming back off of vacation. I'm gonna take a look at this jungle we got going on here. Man, look at them sunflowers. Ooh, right, where'd they go? Right, right there they are. Look at that, they're taller than I am. Oh, so, all right. Look at here, look at here. Got a whole jungle going on. We got some lettuce that kind of come up on its own from last year. I'm letting it go to seed. And we'll collect seeds off it and plant it and grow it. Here we got maters. Look, mater, mater. It's a mater jungle. Look at this. Goodness, look at that pumpkin. That pumpkin just took over here, didn't it? It's wild and crazy. Look, we got maters. Maters coming in. I need to get in here and do some tying up. Everybody going crazy. Yeah. Look, we got peppers and lettuce and carrots. Oh my, look. Cucumbers. And look, look at right here. Oh, ooh, they're starting to ripen. Tasty, tasty maters. That squash is just going wild down here. A whole bed of grass again. <laughs> we got one row tied up real good. You can't really see because there's a jungle behind it, but I got everybody tied up, hanging out, doing their thing. Having a good old time. Next row. There we go. Back from vacation with a jungle up here. And we gotta get this bed here ready. Hadn't done nothing to it since I tilled it up and healed it up, kind of made, shaped it up, I guess. And now it's, you know, a good thick carpet of crabgrass because it's crabgrass. So we're just going to go through with my pitchfork here, break it up little by little, and out there, pop, pick it all out, unfortunately. All right, let's get to it. Here we go. Just using a broad fork, picking it out by hand. Halfway. It's wearing me out. Tried using a hard tine rake to break it up and then rake the grass out after I broke it up with the uh, pitchfork there. But it, it buried a whole lot more and then I'd still having to sift through it by hand. So I just switched back to pulling it by hand. Breaking the ground up first to made them pull out very easily a whole lot easier than just trying to pull them out without breaking the ground up so well, we just got to keep going we got a bunch more pepper plants to put in the ground and this is where they're going all right so that one weeded that about took everything i had all i had to do is come in with my little weed eraser get the edges some of the stuff in the walkways Look at here. I believe this is going to be a zinnia. This is a volunteer from last year. I love volunteer plants. They're free. Free is for me. All right. Let's take a gander at all this pretty yellow squash. Look at all of them. Boy, these plants are just loaded. Loaded, I tell you. Look at, look at, look at. And you come on down here. Can you see the okra? We got three rows of okra. There'll be a lot. Look at there. Patty pans. I'll be darned. We got patty pan squashes coming. So exciting. Never had them before. Oh man, this one's got a bunch on it too. Look at there. Little ones just everywhere everywhere in there i saw a couple zucchinis there's there's a little zucchini they're flowering they just ain't producing yet that's okay they will 